there's going to be a lot of people who buy this stuff and jump on it and start taking it. And they're going to think, wow, this is an alternative to steroids. It's not. The only thing that stays consistent is the grind. Keep on grinding. Hey, what's going on, guys? Welcome back to my supplements corner. I hope all of you are having a wonderful day. Can't wait to get into this video. Had a whole bunch of people hit me up over the last couple of weeks and ask me to do a review, my opinion on the Sigma product from Gorilla Mind. That's what we're gonna get into today. So as you guys might be aware, Derek from More Plates, More Dates has done it again. This man who created Gorilla Mind website with the fantastic products that you can see here that I am not sponsored by has done it again. He has created an all natural testosterone booster. It is there to bridge the gap between doing nothing about your low test levels and TRT, medically prescribed testosterone. Pretty soon we're going to be getting some feedback on this amazing product that he's come about with. He did a two hour video talking about this product and the reason why is because he wants you to know exactly what you're getting into before you jump on this product. There's a lot of reasons behind that. Now I'm going to tell you right off the bat, I have no plans on taking this product. The reason why we'll get into a sh in a short while, and I think it'll be pretty obvious, I'm not going to make this video complicated. There's no need for it. At the end of the day, guys, if you have low testosterone, you might actually be able to fix it on your own. You might be able to sleep more. What do your calories look like? Are you getting enough sunlight? Are you exercising? Are you training? Are you doing those things at an intensity that will actually show benefit in your life? Are you pushing yourself a little bit? Is your nutrition on point? Are you getting enough protein, fat, carbs in order to make your body function properly? Are you getting your vitamins? All of these things are really important. And Derek got into all that in his video. So you know what I love about Derek? He's not looking to just make money. He's looking to fix you. This is a product meant to be a foundational backbone for hormone optimization. It's not meant to be, you know, something that you like just haphazardly jump on. And he has found a way, seemingly, if this product works the way he wants to, he's found a way to fix you if you truly have low testosterone. How would you know if you had low testosterone? You would have gone to the doctor, you would have got blood work done. Uh, maybe some symptoms would have got get you started to get you thinking that you might have had low testosterone. You know, uh, you're not feeling good. You have no energy. You're depressed. You have no sex drive. All this stuff that may have caused you to think, you know what? Maybe have low testosterone. You go to the doctor. You get your blood work done, and they say, yeah, you got low testosterone. They might go ahead and prescribe you testosterone at that point. What if you don't want to take it? Because you will literally be on that if you start taking it for the rest of your life. You're, you will be tied to that ball and chain for the rest of your life because your body will stop producing its own testosterone. So that's where these pills are supposed to come in. It's supposed to be a way that you can get your body producing more testosterone naturally before having to go to the TRT zone, which you may not want to do and may not have to do. Do you have everything dialed in? I wanted to cover dietary intake quickly too, because I don't want to imply that supplementation is the only thing you can do. Uh, it would obviously be prudent to have a comprehensive diet that hits your dietary needs for different vitamins and minerals and nutrients and whatnot in order to support overall physiologic functions, health, vitality, etc. A lot of people are quick to jump to a pill. But let me tell you something right now. If you didn't have the patience to sit down and watch that two hour video that Derek put together, don't bother taking the pill. If you didn't have enough patience to do that, you're not gonna have enough patience to get your blood work done. You're not gonna have enough patience to make sure you're getting your vitamins, your minerals, your sleep, your daily activity, and all that stuff dialed in before you jump onto his Sigma testosterone booster. You have to be very cognizant too of checking your data as you go. Because again, this sort of thing, assessing actual efficacy outcomes, metrics of total T, metrics of LH and FSH, also checking your actual semen parameters and checking sperm counts, motility, morphology, etc. These are things you should be staying on top of if you want to take this seriously. Because Many people want the easy way out. 
You know what I mean? I have a headache every day. Well, I'm going to take an Advil every day instead of trying to figure out the root cause of the problem and fixing it. Maybe you need to sleep more. Maybe you need to stop drinking excessively. Maybe you need more water. So if you don't have your other stuff dialed in, don't take this product. A product meant to be a foundational backbone and for individuals who have done the lifestyle modifications, perfected their diet, have perfect sleep hygiene. And the thing I love about Derek is he literally tells you in his two hour breakdown, if you don't have your stuff dialed in, don't take this product. This product was designed to be that in between between you have optimized lifestyle, which everyone needs to do, nutrients in, circadian rhythm. It's not a Band-Aid. A lot of people, just like myself, when I first saw this, these pills, I said to myself, wait a minute, did he find a way to, to create naturally occurring anabolic steroids? That was the first thing off the bat that I thought. And I, I watched the video breakdown, every single minute of it, and I scrutinized it, and I really thought about what he was saying. And guys, this is medication. This is medication. Before you go on exogenous hormones, is there an in-between that actually works? The this only reason why you would want to take medication is if you are sick, if something is broken. But before you go taking medication to fix something, to fix a problem that you might have, there very well might be more natural ways to fix that problem before you start jumping into pills or whatever the case might be. And, and he, I, I, I admire this guy so much. He gets into, in his two hour breakdown, not only is he telling you that this product is not a Band-Aid, but he's telling you, you must have everything else dialed in first before you start taking it. And he's also telling you how you can fix some of the problems you might have before you take this medication. I wanted to cover dietary intake quickly too. Getting vitamin D through diet, I don't think a lot of people realize that there are vitamin D dense sources of food. Have a comprehensive diet that hits your dietary needs for different vitamins and minerals and nutrients and whatnot in order to support overall physiologic function. So I just wanted to make this uh, quick little breakdown of vitamin D highest containing foods. He's telling you how to fix your problems before you jump on his medication. So if anybody at any point in time thought that this guy's just out to make money, guys, throw that thought out the window. This guy cares about you, okay? You know, he, he's the owner of Merrick Health or, or one of the owners of Merrick Health, his, his health company, right? They are there to help people. And so he's legitimately hopping on YouTube, making a two hour breakdown to help you. If you, have, if you feel like you might have low testosterone right now, before you go to Sigma, taking Sigma, before you go to a testosterone clinic and try to get some testosterone, before you even go to your doctor, you can go to his video, scrutinize the video, listen to what he has to say, and very likely, by the end of that video, you will have every bit of information that you need to naturally increase the most testosterone you can within your body and then you'll know whether you actually need the pills or not, or whether you actually have to get testosterone. You'll know just by watching his video. So that's why I'm not going to be taking Sigma. I have no plans on taking Sigma. I have enough energy. I try to eat the best that I can. I try to get my nutrition in. And keep in mind, guys, if you're taking Sigma, you're gonna have to get your blood work done because there's some real potential for toxicity. And that toxicity can be serious. Stuff all has like a Goldilocks zone. And at some point you are going to enter toxic territory, which there is a certain amount of literature that talks about its toxicity, the amount of studies that have, you know, showing massive increases in total tests on the opposite side of the spectrum. There are data using the exact same dosages that show toxicity outcomes in an escalating manner. This is medication. You can overdose on medication and it might have irreversible consequences. And within that two hour video, he outlines what some of those consequences may or may not be. This stuff is not there to try to help you in an anabolic sense as far as bodybuilding. A lot of his viewer class are gonna look at this and say, wow, I want to get bigger. I want to take steroids. Is this an in-between between not taking steroids and steroids? And there's gonna be a lot of people who buy this stuff and jump on it and start taking it. And they're gonna think, wow, this is an alternative to steroids. It's not. 
This is an alternative to having low testosterone. You can fix your low testosterone through diet, exercise, sleep, a whole bunch of ways. So if you do have low testosterone, keep in mind, there might be ways to fix it without any type of intervention as far as medication goes. If you're deficient in basic nutrients and minerals, you are not going to produce testosterone optimally. Sigma is a medication that should be used when you have no other options. When you've done everything from sleep to nutrition to all that stuff, and you are not, not naturally producing the correct amount of testosterone because you've gone to the doctor, got your blood work done, the doctor has consistently seen that you don't have the proper levels of testosterone, then perhaps this is something you should jump on and it might change your life. This is a very, very thoroughly well thought out product that I think many of you will appreciate who context specifically you know, can make use of it. We don't know yet, right? Because not enough people have taken it. We, we haven't seen how this is going to play out, but it's a medication. And so don't, don't get this confused with just any generic supplement, some kind of multivitamin, and it's not there to help you bodybuild better. The stuff you see people taking as far as TRT, all that stuff, that's doctor prescribed testosterone that very likely they got onto because they wanted to bodybuild better. They may have felt like garbage, because they had no calories. They were bodybuilding like crazy. They had no calories. They, they weren't watching what they were eating. They weren't getting enough sun. All that stuff, they weren't sleeping right. All that stuff, they weren't drinking enough water. All that stuff can contribute to having a horrible overall hormonal profile. You should not want to fix your testosterone from an outside, with an outside source if you're not trying to fix it internally first through your diet and nutrition and all that other stuff. Again, guys, that's why I'm not gonna be taking it because I feel as though I have in my power to go ahead and fix any problems that I may or may not have on my own first. I'm not going to the doctor. I'm not getting my blood work done, okay? I just don't have the patience and time for it and I haven't seen any symptoms that lead me to believe that I should yet. So let me put it like this. You weren't willing to sit down and watch that two hour video learn about testosterone, how it works, why you need it to work properly. If you haven't gone to the doctor to get your blood work done, don't just jump on these pills. Because if you don't have the patience to go do those little things, you don't want to take these pills. Because again, this is not something that could be side effect free at all dosage amounts for all durations of time. Like you gotta, you should be cycling, you should be using a minimum efficacious dose and following your biomarkers. You're gonna have to take these pills, you're gonna have to cycle on and off them, you're gonna have to follow your blood work to make sure you're not getting yourself sick. All this stuff you're gonna have to do. And it very well might be because you just wanna get bigger as far as muscle mass goes. That's not what these are for. This is medication for people who are lacking in natural testosterone, who've done every single thing that they can to fix the problem, but were unable to fix it. I am not an advocate for just taking stuff for no reason. The medications exist, supplements exist, you know, vitamins exist, all this stuff exists for very, very good reason. But you shouldn't be so quick to jump on it if you haven't tried alternatives first. And if you don't have the patience for alternatives and you want the quick fix, you want to take the Advil and make the headache go away, in all honesty, in my opinion, you should not be taking this stuff because you haven't graduated. It's like skipping classes. It's like, it's like going from zero to 100 and skipping all the other numbers in between. There's benefit in learning throughout a course of time, learning through trial and error, figuring out why things exist, why things are happening or not happening, and teaching yourself through quality information. Don't just jump on pills or testosterone just because you want to get bigger, just because you want to be better in the gym, you know, be able to maintain more muscle mass. There's ways of optimizing your own testosterone, and believe me when I tell you, his pills, Sigma, they're not made to get you to be a mass monster. They're not made for that. So don't look at them and be like, oh, I'm gonna buy these, I'm gonna spend that money, I'm gonna take these pills. Before you become a mass monster from those pills, you guarantee you, you will get yourself sick through toxicity. It's not made to be a steroid supplement. 
It's made to help you get your naturally occurring testosterone to the best point possible to give you a better quality of life. All right, guys, be safe. Talk soon. Catch you all at the next video.